sisterhood. I think we really learned that in Colorado, and that's when we started coming together more is when we decided that we were going to be a sisterhood and we were going to support each other more than just as teammates. And part of that is coming together off the field and learning about each other and finding similar interests, serving the community around you together. Talk about the experience being here, what it's like for you. It's like really humbling to know that we're fortunate enough to be healthy. It feels really good to help people. This experience here in Colorado has been a blessing to our team and to the organization as it is a beautiful place where we can help others and where we can grow ourselves as well as the community. The community has given so much to us, and we are so thankful.
all the way to the hotel. Yeah, she's planning on wearing it tonight. Yeah. yeah, I did. I was gonna sleep in it. Good luck. I thought everybody's attitudes today were just really, really good, like all across the board. I had fun. <laughs> yeah. This was fun. Today was fun. Um, flip side of that is it's easy to have fun when you're winning. Yeah. You guys gutted that game out. Mm -hmm. You guys gutted it out, showed a lot of grit that game to pull that one out because we did get down. You guys didn't give up, fought right back, which was awesome for us to finally start to see that come in full circle. But again, remember, keep that mental attitude throughout know that we've got a full roster of people we're going to utilize in a lot of different ways and you never know when your number is going to be called so just be prepared all right hard hat for today person we thought was the best teammate a what you guys earn here today it's a is we get to play the powerful teams now um oh, so you know, always careful what you ask for. Because uh, you might get it, which we're going to get it, which is awesome because it'll give you guys a chance to actually play, you know, the best teams that are out here. So um, just be ready be ready for it tomorrow. I don't know what the uh, what the schedule is yet for tomorrow. Let's go cheer on our teammates tonight um, in the all-academic games. And after that's kind of done, go get some rest. You know, let's come back tomorrow morning getting ready to go. Oh, yeah. Sound good? Yep. Yeah. All right. Oh, Here we go. Sam, don't make fun of her. Put a little cap on our summer. Had a great time this summer. Our athletes really grew. We played the best competition in the country. Probably one of the hardest schedules that the Extreme Elite 16 Gold team has ever played. Just really excited about how these girls kind of ended their season. Looking forward to the next phase of, of where we're heading. Um, getting ready for some off-season development here to see them grow further as athletes and as people. And really looking forward to the next phase in this next 2018-2019 season. So hopefully look forward to seeing, uh, seeing athletes in here and more athletes come into our program because once you experience it I think you're going to see the difference that, that we continue to make in the softball community and continue to grow our athletes.